when setting up for the inverted row, it's important that the J hooks are at even height with one another, but also it is important that the J hook is set at about hip height. This gives us a reference point each time in each week as we progress. On week one, if I start above hip height, I know that on week two, I'm working to get back to hip height. If I start at hip height on week one, then on week two, maybe I'm working to get below hip height. As far as setting up for the inverted row, I'm going to walk my feet out and I want my chest to be slightly behind the barbell. To make this movement easier, I can tuck my feet up to my hips and then bridge up before starting the row. To make this movement harder, I can have my legs straight out once again, bridging my hips up and then pulling my chest to the bar each time. 